Welcome aboard Agra Dolce, a 2021 66 Aston Dillo Flybridge motor yacht. Come on in, I'll show you around. Boat's really designed to be either captain and crew run or just as easily done by an owner operator. As you step in, take note of the uh, large hull side windows, really give a lot of light to this boat. This very light and bright feeling, which was uh, something special that the owner wanted to uh, have the boat specifically feel like. The materials he selected, uh, he hand chose all of the finishes you can see. Very light, very bright, light oak, very light countertops. Here at the helm, you've got a, a nice array of Garmin electronics, uh, bow and stern thruster. The boat is powered with twin 1,200 horsepower man engines, powered with uh, straight shafts. Here we enter the aft galley, which is really designed for entertaining and outdoor living. So you can enjoy al fresco dining here out back on the cockpit. Here I'll point out full-size refrigerator and freezer down below. Lots of custom storage that this owner had done. Cabinetry, all drawer space, which he specifically had designed. Drawers, lots of uh, cabinet space up top as well. So the boat really is designed for long lengthier trips in mind with the additional refrigeration and storage that he's added which i'll point out down the road here this aft deck dining can be configured in two different ways currently it's in kind of chaise lounge mode for relaxing or the center section can lift up into dining mode so you can have uh, full dining out here on the aft deck one very nice option that this owner had built into the boat was the third aft docking system here, which comes obviously with your stern and bow thruster with standard controls and a fusion uh, remote here. So follow me downstairs. We've got uh, some storage here, very conveniently located wine chiller, AV and some other storage compartments located here along the uh, port side. And as you come down, take note of all the stainless steel work, which is made in-house at Aston Doa, which is located in Spain, a family-owned company that have been making boats just like this for about 105 years. Aston Doa happens to be the last name of the family, and they're really fantastic to work with and a lot of fun to build a boat with. So come on back, I'll show you the master. This boat is a three stateroom with utility slash laundry room. So if you look off here at a port, you can peek in and see the uh, stackable washer and dryer with a custom freezer built into the closet. So for an owner operator, this really is an ideal situation. Well, here we are in the uh, master stateroom. Obviously it's a full beam master with uh, beautiful hull side windows. Again, light and bright, white leather, light colored wood. So the boat really has just a very nice, clean, contemporary feel to it. Master head with dual vanity, beautiful walk-in shower with handheld and rain shower. We will take a quick peek into the starboard guest room. This is the side-by-side -side bunk room, which gives your guests a very nice room to call home for a night or two. Then walking forwards, we end up into the VIP with his own private ensuite bathroom, just as the starboard side guest has as well. So this is probably one of my favorite areas of the boat. Great bow seating with sun pad as well as this really cool bimini top to keep you out of the sun on those hot summer days. And finally, the best spot in the house, Flybridge. So welcome up top. We've got a, uh, again, duplicated from down below, Garmin Electronics, bow and stern thruster, and a really cool custom made barbecue that the Aston Doa factory designed and installed for this particular owner. Flybridge Dining. Here we have the uh, Flybridge sun pad, which in its current position has the headrest folded up, but they can be laid flat as well. One really nice feature, no more canvas on the opening section of the hardtop. As you can see, this metal louver system gives you a lot of options as far as where to stop the louvers and be totally dry and eliminate the mildew and flapping that you get with the canvas. So this is a really cool feature on this boat. When it's closed, it's totally sealed and totally dry with no sun coming through. Here we have the wet bar with an additional electric grill, cutting board, fridge, as well as storage located here. So really a nice setup for entertaining. So located aft, we have uh, 
The hydraulic platform and crew quarter entrance. On the days when you're anchored out at the sandbar, this makes a fantastic area to drop the platform and sit with your toes in the water. And here located on the transom, we have crew quarter access. The 66 Ascendoa has room for two. Private head and shower with engine room access. Come on in. This particular boat was built with the Sea Keeper 9 for stabilization. As I mentioned before, this is where the 1200 horsepower mans do their work. One extra little feature here, fridge, billet, custom fridge just for the crew. So thanks for checking out Agridolce. Hope you guys enjoyed the tour. Give me a call if you have any questions.